Hello everyone, in this video we will see how we can interact with ServiceNow using a chatbot. So let's have a look at our ServiceNow instance. Here we can see we have one incident and one request. So let's get back to our chatbot which we have designed in IntelliBot version 2. This chatbot has been configured to perform three operations. One is create incident, second one is get incidents and get request. And there's another context for small talk. So all the utterances have already been added and the model has been trained. So let's go ahead, try if this is working. So here we can test our NLP engine. Let's write here, please issue me a new mouse. My employee ID is 645. So it detected that it is an incident, create incident. So it was able to detect the description which is mouse and the employee ID, the ID is 645 from this text. So let's go ahead, run our automation. Here I have three different activities designed for each of the requests. So let's go ahead, run this automation and try to get all requests from ServiceNow. Please show me all requests. Getting all requests. So. We can see in the automation flow here it goes to service now and gets the request which is for an Apple iPad 3 and the request number is this. Let's see how it executed. So it understood this action that it was for get requests. This was the message that the user gave and it identified the intent and the context for the same. Went ahead, executed this get requests activity which sends a query for getting requests that are active and then displays it in the chat. Let's try doing something else. Let's ask it to show all incidents that are active. Can you show me incidents? Getting all incidents. So there's only one incident as we saw. Uh, laptop is slow, upgrade RAM to 16 GB is the description. And it also gives us the incident number here. So let's go ahead and verify if there's one incident for the same. So let's go to service now and here we can see that this one incident says laptop slow and this is the incident number. Let's get back to the chatbot. Ask it to create a new incident. Hey, my mouse is not working. Please issue me a new one. As it has an LP, it can understand everything. So let's say employee ID 239. So a new incident has been created successfully and the incident number is INC0010002. We can go back to the ServiceNow portal and verify. Now we can see two incidents are here. One was laptop slow, the other one is replace mouse. Let's go back to our chatbot and try to get all instances now. Run it again. Get all incidents. So now because there are two incidents, both of them were fetched from ServiceNow and displayed in the chat here. So that is how easy it is to create chatbots from IntelliBot Studio and integrate it with ServiceNow. Thank you. IntelliBot. Excellence made simple.